Hello and welcome to a new video. Today, I want to show you the updated background removal feature on Image R. Let's get started. First, navigate to image-r.com and click on background removal in the top menu. It's really straightforward. Just upload your image and wait for the magic to happen. As you can see, it perfectly removed the background. No weird spots, no strange lines around the cutout, and no artifacts. Click on Download to save the result as a PNG file. Let's try another one. Even if the background is very close in color to the subject, the removal tool still detects all the edges perfectly. Now let's prepare one of the images for engraving. First, upload it to the Image R main site. I'll use Easy Mode. In the next step, we can crop the image if there are any unnecessary areas. In my case, I'll remove all the empty space. I want to engrave it with a width of 180 millimeters. The height is calculated automatically. I use 318 dpi for my 80 watt CO2 laser. Since I'm engraving on birch, I'll choose wood as the template. Here is the result, with much better shading and more detail. To make sure I don't overburn any areas, I'll click Lighten Image once. This makes the image more vibrant and less dark, especially around the eye area. Click on Download to save the final image. If you like the result, please let us know. Now let's open the laser software and import the image. I'll create a rectangle with the exact same dimensions since I want to cut out the image precisely. These are my settings for an 80-watt CO2 laser on birch plywood. I recommend going slow and low to get rich, dark engravings. Now let's run the task. As you can see, the image has a great range of blacks, but no burned areas. It turned out absolutely perfect. The whole process took about 38 minutes, and I didn't treat the wood before or after engraving. I hope you enjoyed the video. Try out the new background removal tool and prepare your image with easy mode. Image R offers you three free daily uploads, so don't hesitate and give it a go.